Small words and stuff. Yeah. Yeah. Hello. Hello. Hey. We've now <laughs> we've now had a reprieve from that horrendous. We, we took a musical experience. theater break and now we're all in a much better place. Uh, slightly. Slightly. Are we still, are we still talking about? I games? am gamer. Gamer, I am. I'm Melbys. Yes, King. Did you just turn into Yoda for a second? <laughs> gamer, gamer, I am. Oh, game audio. Oh my god, game audio. Thank you for reminding me. So oh this is, yes, this is this the is genie world. This is what I was talking about earlier, where the genie world looks nothing, utterly nothing, like the Never Had a Friend Like Me musical number, and it's still beautiful, and it's still a kick-ass stage, but I feel like Disney had contacted Capcom and was like, um, look, we have to reanimate the entire song because we put a microphone in front of Robin Williams and he just ad-libbed for like 15 minutes. <laughs> so, uh... Yeah, so that happened. So ju just make something up, it'll be fine. <laughs> just, just do whatever you want. Okay, so last episode we started talking about, um, our bedroom preferences. Kinks! Or just um, like, fetishes or whatever. Fetishes in general. Um... Because there's a lot of stuff you can't actually do that you like still think is hot. Yeah. Like, like people That's who are not into, realistic. Well, like people who are into boar. Yeah. Y'all know what boar is? I know what boar is. Boar. It's when boar. you... Oh, you don't know what boar is? I might. Boar is... It's kind of a furry thing. Yeah. Oh, okay. And it's um the, the desire to be, like, not just eaten, but specifically swallowed whole by a monster, like a dragon or something. And or a titan. Yeah. Oh, oh god, yes. Yeah. <laughs> Attack on Titan, like... It took over the vor. Revitalized fetish. the yeah. vor community, yeah. Um, <laughs> and, like, in the art... Oh! Oh, that was an enemy. <laughs> the genie's like, no! He's like, no! My <laughs> new friend is dying. I will! That's <laughs> funny as hell. He freaked me out, I'm sorry. <laughs> I like how there's just the flashing genie sign, like... Okie dokie. <sighs> but yeah, so like when people write like gore erotica, like, you know, they'll they'll skip the whole story that like gets to the point of like why someone's being eaten by a monster. Should we save state? No, I guess it doesn't matter. Oh well we save stated yeah. before we got here. Yeah. I'm just I'm still in panic mode from the cave. This level is significantly easier. Yeah. Like even if the platform is technically harder, because it's such a peaceful, pretty background. Like that's what's it's so easier on your mind. From from a damn it. <laughs> from a level design standpoint, that's what I do love about the Cave of Wonder stages is because it adds like that forced anxiety yeah. by having the moving background and by having all like the, the exploding cave lava shits. Like it's fantastic when you're not playing it. Like <laughs> just from an appreciative standpoint. Hmm. But yeah, so war fanfic, like, oh man. I got to, when I met Ryan, my boyfriend, um, I got to tell him what Vore was, and it broke his brain. It was so <laughs> funny. He just couldn't even process. I love that when it happens. Like, when I get to be the one to tell someone about something, it makes me so happy. Like, whatever it is. Like, just this... You know, <laughs> sharing in this new moment. Yeah, well, because I'm just so used to, you know, people just being like, oh yeah, I know that. And I'm like, oh cool. But when it's like, I get to be the one to introduce someone to something, I'm just like, oh! Like, it makes me really happy. So, especially when it's something funny and or fucked up. Like, yeah. Like, war. So, like, it'll be like, oh, the night. Oh, you no, know. help you. That's stupid. Oh, balls. Oh, God. Oh, Fuck. no. That was yeah. not helpful, Genie. This part's gonna get The Genie's like, what? It's like, Genie, why don't you just warp me to the end of the level? Jesus. But, yeah, so, um, my last one was. Um, binding. Yeah, like you did. You did too. Now, now we all. So have now to we're go now we're on to Tim, who's on his second one. Oh, I missed one. Are you into four? Four. There's no shame here. It's no, it no, was, no kink shame. Oh, um, oh yeah, so that's then right. So then Melanie's got to cough up too. I can you show should. you a third one. That's fine. Um. Oh man, this is a really <laughs> serious one. Oh god. Slightly serious. Bring it on. I mean, no we judgment. Have, we, we, have already, we already discussed the, <laughs> the judge free zone. I know, right? I like how the genie heads that you're jumping like, on. Oh! He's like, oh! Oh! Um. Ah! This is not really a fetish, but like. 
Actually, I'm not going to do that one because I want people to look for me. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, let's, let's not incriminate ourselves. Yeah, let's just give Tim his, their grind <laughs> already. Let me just... Roll play. Okay. I'll probably take you guys on. Okay. okay. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, I'll do a few. Well, like, I'm so... I, uh, I'm so, like, domestic and comfortable in my relationship right now that, like, we don't really do weird shit. Like, yeah. But, so I'm trying to, like, I guess just think back to, like... Think the, outside the box. Um... God. Like, so many of mine are, like, things that I haven't actually done. Just, like, things that I think are cool. Mm-hmm. Not that, you know... Well, that's what my next one is gonna be. Like. I mean, like, I've done some shit. Like, don't get me wrong. Um... I mean, I guess, I guess exhibitionism to, like, a, a degree. When I was a teenager, like, my first boyfriend went, okay, so here's, uh, my parents are never going to watch this, whatever. Um, I went to a concert with um, two of my female friends and the dude I was dating at the time. And after the this concert, it's pretty fucking black. After the concert, um, when we were driving home, my two friends were in the front, and my boyfriend and I were in the back seat, and I gave Thanks. a blowjob <laughs> in front of them, and it was kind of awesome. <laughs> and Props. yeah, and Mad well, respect. yeah, well that's Impressive. that's how we rolled. Like we're me and my social circle from that part of my life, we were just pretty shameless. Circle up. Yeah. Well, it was pretty easy for me to discover that I was bisexual early. Like, I, well, I remember having a conversation with a friend of mine who is straight, and I just remember being like, yeah, it's like sometimes you want to make out with a girl. And she was like, what? And I'm like, well, yeah, like, everyone does that, right? Like, sometimes, you know, you, like, you're in dudes, but, like, you know, girls are equally cool. And she was like, I don't feel that way. And I was like, oh, I'm bi. <laughs> <laughs> oh, goddamn, I'm bisexual. I mean, it, it was just kind of like, oh, okay, well, that's cool. Like, it wasn't, um, I don't know. I already knew. <laughs> I think it was just a matter of saying it out loud. That, that solidified it. Yeah, well, like, I had so many girl crushes when I was, like, a little kid. Like, um, uh, Jadzia Dax from Star Trek Deep Space Nine. Okay, so that, yeah, one, that, yeah. one, that one was lost. Sorry. She's hot, so. That was the last Google call. Google it. Google Jadzia Dax Deep Space Nine. She's fucking killer hot. Well, she has, um, her, her thing is that she's an alien, but. And this is so 90s. Like, the only thing that marked her as an alien was that she had, um, starting at her temple on either side, she had, like, leopard print tattoos. <laughs> or, well, I guess it was markings. Like, I guess it was, like, how her skin actually looked. Ooh. And, um, they went, according to her, they didn't show it, but it comes up in an episode, they went all the way down. <laughs> and I just remember being like, Ooh, I'd like to see that. And then um, her character, too, um, was, I'm going to get rant bastard for saying this because it's a super over oversimplification, but she was basically bisexual. Um, she was an alien species who could remember, like, past lives of other members of that species, so she had, like, memories of... Why would come No. I don't understand. She had memories of men that, like, were part of her active consciousness, and there was an episode where, like, she met the, the lover of a guy that she had a memory of, so, like, she also was interested in this woman, and, like, they got it on, and then she went to, like, a convention to do an appearance and of course, all the motherfucking like neckbeards in the crowd were like, oh, oh, talk about the girl thing. <laughs> and like some guy like actually got up. It was like a Q and A panel, and they were like, "What was it like to kiss that girl?" And without missing a beat, like this is a true story. She goes, "Have you ever kissed a girl?" <laughs> and he he goes, "Yeah." And she goes, "It's like that." <laughs> I'm like, God, that's so yes, cool. Yes, damn. That's such, yeah! Oh my god! <laughs> Ow! What are you was supposed it? to do? Ow! Look at the monkey in the back, like in the background, you just see how blue like. It was very low. Wow. Like, um. Oh, you have to jump off of it because you're too heavy. You have to jump on it and then keep jumping and it goes up. Yeah. This is some poor shit. Um, I take back everything I said about this being an easy, relaxing level. I lied. <laughs> no. no. <laughs> Maybe with the music it would help, but. That is. Yeah, it's just. 
<laughs> What's funny though is that everyone watching this is going to be hearing the music. <laughs> yeah, and we're all just like, eh, <laughs> we're we're just gonna gonna be dead silence right now. Yeah. Until we get nice equipment, we can. We yeah, can when we get whoop. nicer equipment. Um, I mean, like for me at least, like I'm I'm very open with my dorkiness. I yeah. watch a heck of a lot of anime, like just so much anime. And there's like a lot of situations like in those shows that like it would be super well it would be like super cool to like be in that like a fantasy situation to like meet someone and like oh, what? Them. Why does Melanie get a different, different one? The fuck is that? Where was she gonna I was expecting the card! <laughs> I was I was like, here comes the card, and then I was like, oh a cloud. Why? Fine, I guess I'll play. Okay, so apparently it's random. But only when I play after we've done it fifteen times. <laughs> Or maybe he's just like, look, this is apparently too hard for you, so get the cloud. <laughs> I hate it when games do that. Where they're like, do you want to skip you want the handicap? difficulty level? Do you want to go easy? Do like, how dare you? Let's just skip the level. It's like, no! It like motivates you to do better. I guess if you, I guess I can tell you guys this one. So yeah, like, I'm, in that, in that um, way, I'm kind of a hopeless We're all friends here, unless potentially anyone romantic. who's ever going to watch this on the internet. Yeah. <laughs> I don't give a um, shit. Man, there's naked I really people like out there. The, um, don't go looking for them. You don't want to see that. <laughs> <laughs> I really like the um, denial of release. Yeah. When, uh, when you want there's a term for it. Max. It's like orgasm denial. Yes. Yeah. Oh, that sounds awful. <laughs> 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 Brandon, Brandon. <laughs> that sounds well, absolutely you do it dreadful. eventually, but it's like, okay, oh god, like, I'm about Brandon, to... Brandon, okay, the term, for you people at home, I'm sorry, <laughs> and not sorry, Brandon, it was called edging. Oh. <laughs> I knew that, actually. I, I <laughs> oh, okay, I thought you just meant straight up blue balls, yeah, like, no, you, no, you no, get god, right there, you, you just get right eventually. there, and then you just, like, stop. No, that's a whole other no. thing. No. No, no. Okay, okay, I'll that okay, that I totally understand. A, See, I just a, misinterpreted what you what it's, you it's meant. It's a postponing. That. It's not a straight up denial yeah. threat. Yeah. <laughs> that sounds awful. <laughs> uh, we're we're bonding. Us in the audience. Well, look yeah. at that, look at that. Give me the fucking card. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Yeah. On the upswing. Yes. Oh, oh another card. Oh god. Another card. Oh god. Oh man. <laughs> what the f this is genie, crazy. you ass, and I was right next to the end. I like how the genie's all slack jawed, like you can't believe you died. It's like, well, s just give me, give me a car. Give me a some fucking substance. Give me a road, <laughs> not all this horse shit that I have to parkour off of. Oh, gosh, I'll all right, well, for to take me right now. <laughs> or I'll take him. Uh, whatever. So. Yeah. <laughs> You and, you know, you and Dwight and Aladdin can make a sandwich. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> you, get to, you get to figure he out. He is obviously it's going a, to shower, though. It's a cock meat sandwich. <laughs> yeah. As much as he claims his street rapness, I know. He needs yeah, to shower. Yeah, you need to shower and make sure there's no diseases involved. Get some new pants. He's got a genie. He can wear such a word. <laughs> he kind of did in the movie, didn't he? He like oh, he, he basically did. in a in a roundabout, complicated way, like wished for a shower and some nice clothes. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Genie like cleaned him up and like, gave him a new hat. <laughs> yeah, he was like, "You can't wish for love, and no wishing for more wishes." This new hat though. Yeah, he's like. All right. He's, he's like, you can. He's like, you can make them fall. In Why love. do I get the so clothes? How don't, question don't, it. don't question it, just let just it happen. Do it. Don't be afraid to let it touch you. Just do it. <laughs> I see what you're talking about now. Boo is just like flying ah. in the background. I'm like, what the fuck? How in the ever loving tit fuck did that just it's happen? It's okay. It's okay, guess. just accept it. Okay, this is the part where now you have to swing. Oh, you did it! Yay! Yay. This is the and safe state. <laughs> Yay, we did it. We did it. Join the explorer. We did it. What? Oh, Hooray! Something, something. <laughs> Immediately died. We did it though, and stuff. Yeah. We're just gonna have to keep loading this one save state repeatedly. Aladdin's like, yeah. This is so fucking like oh. surreal. The genie's like, ooh. <laughs> 
He's gonna take you with him. Oh my god, yeah, he's like, off to heaven! Can we yes. talk about the bird pot and how disturbing that is? Pot bird Yeah, animal. why do they exist? Well, it's like... I don't know, man. So many unanswered questions. That wasn't, Get off. that wasn't in the movie. This has turned out to be a really fun playthrough. I'm glad it really that has. I'm glad we, I'm glad we mutually out. agreed on yeah, this. We, no spoilers, but like the other things that were discussed, I super duper 1000% want to play them. Yeah, we just need to have a little just, bit more preparedness. Well, I, I could kind of sense that we were all... I just don't think they would have been good episodes, at least from me. Because I, I just would have been like, okay. <laughs> Alright. Yeah, we need to have another day where we did that huge... Yeah, where we did a long a period of... Yeah. Well, like I said, because of the things that have happened in my personal life, um, yeah. well, I took the time off to go to the other job, but mm -hmm. um, since I'm not going there, but I've still got the time off, I'm, like, super open. Okay. Yeah, we'll, I we'll figure something out. Those days. Whew! Are we well, out of kinks? Like, should we change the subject? Um, this is a lot. <laughs> I mean, I have, I have a lot of kinks. Um, I mean, Ooh, no, I, I guess it's not like, really a kink, but I like, just, sorry, sorry. No, just... I like rough, well, very rough. I like, uh. I like nails, scratching and biting, and yeah. things of that nature. That's pretty. That's pretty. Pretty rad. Oh no, Genie! Oh god, Genie, no! Oh no, Genie! Why would you die? <laughs> he just keeps dying. <laughs> He's just in an infinite loop of suicide. He's just like, save me, Al! Save Al. Al. He owl. calls him Al. He, he does, the Genie, oh, calls owl. Him, the Genie calls him Al. At least an owl. <laughs> I was like, this is not Winnie the Pooh or Zelda. <laughs> 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 Um, uh, but yeah, that's mine. I enjoy very rough sex. I believe Sweet. you. Yeah, considering you look at my trash can. I mean, oh, I was totally like not gonna bring it up, and then once y'all started talking about boning, I was just like, well, this is this, this is applicable. Is, this, this is good yeah. times, honey. It's always a good time. So I'm <laughs> about So this is for the record. This is something that I have. Unfortunately, not done. However, <laughs> I, I, if I end up, you know, with the person I'm currently with, I probably won't ever do it because I don't think he'd be into it. But I think it's hot. I'm, I, I am attracted to the concept of uh, <clears throat> pegging. Y'all know what pegging is? I do not. Pegging is <laughs> when a girl most of the time. I can't imagine really why a guy would do it, but um, it's basically when a girl uses a strap-on and uh, uses it on a dude. Oh, is that what that is? That's what I've always called it. Oh. Yeah. I, I figured that's what it was, but I didn't know there was <laughs> I've just actually... always called it a lady with a strap-on fucking a dude. <laughs> <laughs> on that on that topic, <laughs> Bo Burnham, one of my favorite comedians, All right, I'm a fan. Um, had a bit. And he brings that up a lot. <laughs> <laughs> he, had, he had a bit where he was like, um, "Oh God, I know exactly what he you're was gonna like, say." He was like, "Men, he's like, women are stupid." Yeah, I said it. They're the weaker, dumber sex. Why? <laughs> Cause I like to practice safe sex. Why? Cause I'm a guy and I'm smart. What did she say? Every time I put a condom on. Every time I put a condom on. Why are you putting on a condom if I'm fucking with a strap on? To be safe, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, women, they're the dumb ones. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he's he brings that up in his comedy like really. I respect that that like he's so nonchalant about it. Like yeah, he was. I was just watching a stand up thing <laughs> the other night. And he was, and he was like, "Yeah, I brought it up to this girl, and she's like, oh, does that mean like you want like a man to fuck you in the ass?'" And he's like, well, "No, at this moment, like, <laughs> like not, not, maybe not at this point in my life, 
<laughs> and he start he starts off like the same bit. He starts off like right off the bat. He's yeah, like immediately. He's like he's like where are my fellas at? Let me get my fellas in my room, fellas. And they're like woo. And he's like don't you hate it when you're blowing a guy and he turns out to be a faggot? Oh my god. <laughs> Oh, jeez. Oh, my God. He's like, what? Really? I've been blowing a faggot this whole time? Third time this week. Thank you. Oh, my God. <laughs> that is a punchline that I really like. Yeah. I mean, it's 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 not really funny. <laughs> but, wait, how did I end up at the title screen? Um, we died. I've been living the same six. <laughs> I think... He died right here. I think I think that's the end. I think that's gonna be the end of this episode. I don't think we can handle it anymore. Okay. Um yes. Thank you for joining us again on our very inappropriate conversation. It just keeps getting better. It just keeps getting better. Um like this and comment and subscribe if you hate when you end up blowing a guy and he turns out to be a faggot. Or if you're into pegging. Or if you're into pegging. Or feet. Yes, if you um, if you enjoy if you enjoy any of those things, please <laughs> please subscribe. <laughs> um, but yeah, we'll see you next time, guys. Bye. 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 Bye.